Hi guys, this is V. I'm going to go over um, the items that I picked up from the One Wonder Woman collection by MAC. Um, happy Saturday! I don't have any makeup on and my hair isn't did or anything, so but um, I just wanted to get this up right quick because I haven't done a video in like forever. And the first item I purchased and was really excited about, um, I picked it up lot on um, Tuesday at their pre-launch event, and is this is the packaging. I mean, if any little girl ever grew up in like the late 70s, early 80s, loves Wonder Woman. I used to love Wonder Woman, play Wonder Woman with like, pew, pew, with um, the hula hoop and stuff, so, and the baton. So anyway, this is Mighty Aphrodite, the powder blush. And it comes with a mirror, but I won't show this. The mirror is in the top portion. But it's just a gorgeous blush. I have been wearing it every day since I purchased it. The lighter color, I mix the two. And I do a quick swatch. You really can't see it, but you see? It's like iridescent. Them together, maybe it'll be better. Yeah. See the darker one? That's them together. It's just really pretty. It looks awesome on the face. Um, The lighter color has like kind of like peachy gold reflex in it. I'm going to just keep doing it. As you can see it, I just put the gold one here. The lighter one. And then the darker one. Right there. So, oops. Sorry. There you go, right there. So it's just, it's just pretty. I love it. Um, it's not really doing it justice on camera, but it's gorgeous. And that was... Hmm. I'm thinking it's like $30, excuse me, $20 or something. I'm not sure. But um, probably $24. I don't know what the price tag on it, but this is it is on it's on the Max website. And the next thing that I purchased that I had on my list is crap. I can't think of the colors, and the receipt doesn't have it on here. That was Mighty Aphrodite. I wonder why they don't have the colors listed on here. But this is like the nude pink one, the lip gloss. Look how huge that is, you guys. I mean, this is ridiculous. I'm like. Um, I should go get a, like, look at that. It comes out kind of funky. Like, look at the applicator. This is a nude lip gloss. And my phone is downstairs, so I don't have it. But, I don't know. You all probably know it. But, anyway, it's the pinky looking one. It's kind of like, you know, it's nothing special about it. Except for that it's ginormous. Um, I like it. It's like a pinky. Let me see. You can see, no, you can't really tell, but my, it's raining here today, so, but anyway, okay, this, this that, I'm is, sure the okay, this is Emancipation, I thought about the name of it, okay, this is the tube for the Wonder Woman, Wonder Woman collection, and this is the normal tube, oh my gosh, look at that, isn't that ridiculous, like, look how t huge it is, so, it's like super size, and I must admit I have to play around with the doe foot applicator. It's like huge, but anyway, that's that one. I really like the color. I mean, it's like really, it's not that much difference between the go to the um easy lounger from the to the beach collection. I don't think it's just that the to the beach collection. Uh, excuse me, to the Beach Collection one has more glitter in it. So I like it. Yeah, Emancipation. It is on there. Sticker is on there, but I just can't see it in this horrible lighting. And then the lip gloss, which lipstick, I didn't have any attention on buying this one, but I bought it um, when I saw it on the um, MAC um, Girl. And this um, Marquise D. Marquise D. I don't know. Whatever. It's pretty. Um, do a quick swatch. It's really pretty pink. Pinkish nude. I like it. It's really, it reminds me of the same 
lipstick that I was in love with from the To The Beach collection. But, of course, I can't think of that name of that one either. But, um, X that. It doesn't look like Lazy Day. But, anyway, um, I like it. So, and then the thing that I totally did not have on my list. Like, look at that. The packaging is so awesome. I think I might save that. I don't know. I usually don't. But, is the blue mascara. It's really pretty. And I think, I don't know, it might be sold out. I don't know if they, they said at the Mac store that everybody was calling to, I don't want to open it because, you know, the shelf life on mascara is so small, but it's um really pretty. Opulash um, formula, and I'll just open it. Who cares? And that's the blue. Isn't that pretty? Can you see? Ooh. I like it. It's totally different for me because I just use black, very black or the ultra's black, carbon black, whatever black. So I don't know. I just love the packaging on this. But that's my haul from the Wonder Woman Mac collection, and I would love to know what you guys got picked up. I didn't really wasn't impressed by the quads, the eye colors and stuff. So I just got. I really love like out of all the. Like, the little small purchase that I did, this one, oh, I'm tempted to buy a backup, but I'm not. I mean, because this thing, this blush is huge. I should have bought another blush to compare it, but look at that. It's huge. So, Mighty Aphrodite is my number one from this collection. I think it would look good on any skin tone. I mean, that's what my suggestion would be. My favorite for the collection and thanks for coming by watch my videos talk to you soon take care bye, -bye.